Hey guys, thanks for checking out my YouTube channel. My name is Mathis and today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my top five favorite inspirational books. I really enjoy reading inspirational books because they really put me in a great mood and they also give me a different view on life. I have a few books here that I'd like to show you guys and hopefully these books will be an interest to you. So the first book that I have here guys is The Power of Now by Akhar Tolle. This book is all about living in the present moment and not drilling on the past. But he really makes that clear throughout the book. So this book is written in a Q&A format. I can give you guys an example. So I really like the format of this book. It was written in a way that is easy to understand and I really like that. I really recommend this book if you are feeling depressed or feeling stuck in your life or if you are feeling just not motivated. And so if you feel any of those things, this is the book for you. The second book that I have here, guys, is Ruben Sharma, The Monk Who Sold His Ferrari. This book is centered around this high-profile lawyer. He is just out of control. He enjoys living a fast life. And so until one day, he suffers a massive heart attack and he have an epiphany that, you know, life isn't always promised tomorrow. And so he goes on this life journey to... India and um, there he becomes very infatuated with the philosophies of Buddhism. Once he learned the philosophies of Buddhism he takes it back home to America and he shared them with his close colleague who is um, having trouble balancing work and his family life. It talks a lot about vision boards. I'm not going to get into that. You can e easily type in vision boards on YouTube and you can watch tons of videos of people you know making vision boards. He also talks about other things that are very inspirational like um, dieting and how to get your day started early in the morning. He talks about procrastination. Uh, he talks about resistance uh, on finishing your projects. There's just a lot of wisdom in this book guys. I mean so much that I normally don't mark in my books but in this one, I just had to highlight a lot of things, and this is all uh, the stuff that I highlighted. If you were about, you know, it being very spiritual and very preachy and all that stuff, do not worry about that. This book is not like that. It's just reminding you on the things you should do, like eat right, get up early, and um, exercising. Is just things that you should the things you're supposed to do. So uh, yeah, so I really recommend this book, guys. So the third book that I like to talk about, guys, is Peace from Broken Pieces by Ilana Franzant. I really enjoyed this book. Uh, it it actually inspired my YouTube channel. So yeah. So this book talks a lot about her nasty divorce, how she lost her job on the Oprah show, how she was in a, a abusive relationship. Um, how she was bankrupt and um, how she lost her daughter to cancer. You know, it's just amazing how she persevered through all that. So I would recommend this book if you enjoy authors like Toni Morrison or if you like Maya Angelou. Now, if you like those people, you would definitely like this author. The fourth book that I have here, guys, is The Secret by Rhonda Byrne. I came across this book by my sister-in-law. She visited me last year, and she saw me reading an inspirational book, and she said, hey, have you read The Secret? And I was like, no, what's The Secret? And so... Uh, she, uh, you know, she brought this book to my attention and so I decided to check it out from the library and I found it very fascinating. It talks about the universe and karma and, and about the law of attraction. And so it's like what you put out into the universe, it comes back to you. So this is a small little book and it just has ancient lessons on how to live life. It's a very fast read. I finished this book, I think, within uh, a couple of days. It's, it's really well written and um, yeah. So the last book that I have here guys is called The Four Agreements by Miguel Ruth. So I came across this book in a bookstore one day and I decided to give it a shot and I 
thoroughly enjoy this book guys uh, it's a very quick read it's a very small book and it is just old teachings uh, from a culture called the Totak basically it's a, it was a culture um, set in Central America and it's just a set of people that follow these rules to live a more healthy and prosperous life. This book was very insightful, very uplifting and it's just, I don't know, it just leaves you feeling so good. What I particularly like about this book is that it helps you improve with your people skills and so you get a lot from this book and so that is it guys that is my top five favorite inspirational books i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll talk to y'all later all right bye